So here we are on a bit of Offers Dyke. I'm actually standing on the bank of Offers Dyke. And the first thing you'll probably say is, well, where, Howard? Well, that's the point, isn't it? In many parts of this greatest monument we have surviving, uh, running for over 70 or 80 miles, depending on who you talk to, um, we have sections which have been completely destroyed. And here you have to get your eye in and realise that behind me, this is the bank of Offers Dyke. Originally three metres tall, perhaps, at this point, with a two and a half metre to three metre ditch on its western side, completely obliterated apart from this slight bank. Now, if you follow around and look over here, the other way, moving into woodlands, you can see that the ditch survives as a low depression here next to the road to the south of Trevonan. So this is what happens to a monument that in the 8th century, in the late 8th century, would have been huge in proportion, taken many, many hundreds of people to construct in this section, and yet now it is very denuded. In fact, I don't think there's a sign or any local awareness that this is off the dike, as it runs up the hill towards the south, looking westwards out over um, Welsh territory and controlling this small valley um, and, and access along it and through it.